Well, it's welcome news that the IUCN can now report that the rhino populations around Africa are actually increasing by two and a half percent. In particular, the southern white rhino and the southern black rhino are doing quite well. Uh, here in East Africa, the eastern black rhino is actually still in critically endangered situation. And of course, the northern white rhino, there are just two individuals left. So their results, I think we have to take it very cautiously. So there are several strategies that have worked and which might explain why the rhinos are doing quite well right now in Africa. First, we have almost a military style of protecting them. That means uh, very good security, very good intelligence and very rapid response to any threats. But our rhinos are actually in, mainly in small isolated populations. And we know that when they breed, their numbers will reach a point where there are too many and they will slow down their breeding. So we have to keep either expanding those landscapes, but also moving and crossing some of the adults so that there's no inbreeding. This has worked really well and we've been able to achieve over 4% of a population increase in this country by doing that strategy. The main threats to rhinos, apart from poachers, are actually lions who go after their calves. And so in many places, it's really important to have actual security around the rhinos all the time. There are three major challenges still facing rhinos today. The first is the demand for rhino horn in Asia. So long as that demand remains, the price will stay high and the incentive for poaching will continue across Africa. <laughs> The prevention of poaching requires very good intelligence, extremely good anti-poaching efforts, and that is expensive. 
it means that we have to have almost a military style approach to protecting these animals. The third challenge is actually related to the long term. So while numbers might be increasing, where will we put these animals? They need large and interconnected landscapes. At the moment, we have rhinos in small pockets. We have some protected areas, but we haven't got a strategy in Africa at this moment in time to secure contiguous protected areas, interconnectedness, and especially at a time when there's so much development happening, what we have is actually under increasing threat. Do you want to go to the hospital? Yes. Do you want to go to the hospital? Yes.